used to just be the intro like this. All these bad bitches say they love me, I already know. Check the pick the ping that's on my finger, cause I'm a ho. Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Jules here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to make gaming videos on your iPhone. So, I've been doing YouTube for three years, and for editing, I only use my iPhone. A lot of people are surprised by that because most people use a PC or a laptop at least. Unfortunately, I do not have those, but I am looking forward to upgrading. But if you're like me and all you have is an iPhone and you want to make gaming videos too, then I'm going to teach you step by step how to do that. So if you guys enjoy this video, please leave a like and subscribe to Jules down below. Remember to follow my social medias. They are linked in the description. Support my grind for hype. Hashtag hype Jules. And yeah, let's just get into this video. Okay, so the first thing I do when I'm about to record a YouTube video is I set up my camera. And I have the iPhone XR and I use the back camera because it is better quality than the front. So I do not have a PC, I have a TV and a tripod that I put on top of the TV for my phone. And that's just to record my face cam. Way back when I first started and I didn't know a PS4 recorder existed, I would actually record the TV screen with my iPhone, which was even worse. <laughs> but if you have a PlayStation, and I think Xbox lets you record too, I basically just start the video and I start my face cam at the same time so it's not exactly synced up i fixed that in editing and since i'm on my phone i don't record for hours at a time i like to do five six minutes and for call of duty for example i'll do like five minutes for each map that i play and that will usually be three different gameplay videos that i need to put together so yeah, when I'm done with that clip, I just double click the share button and it'll save the gameplay. And then I end my face cam video. So I just do that process until I feel like I have enough footage to make one video. And when I put them all together, it usually ends up being either 15 to 25 minutes so you're probably wondering how do you get the gameplay to your phone and now this is like a really really annoying process and this is why i wish i had a pc i click the share button i upload all the clips to youtube and to stay organized i will label them one two and three or however many there are so now all my gameplay is on YouTube but it's unlisted so no one else can see it and as for my face cam I make sure that is one big video as well so I take all my face cam parts put them together and just so that they're the same size over the gameplay do you know what I mean that's where I would put like my face cam border if I wanted to so then I have my face cam ready. So I do have this laptop that I honestly think I got like seven years ago. It is so old. It can't run any editing software on it. Trust me, I tried, but it can download YouTube videos. So I use this thing called 4K Video Downloader on my laptop and I go to my YouTube Creator Studio and I take the links from the gameplay and I put it into the 4K video downloader so that now the videos are on my laptop's files. Next step, I go to my Google Drive and I upload all the gameplay to my Google Drive. And on your phone, you can get the app Google Drive and therefore you will now have the gameplay. You will now have the gameplay on your phone. So I use the app CuteCut Pro. I think it was like six dollars. So I set up my intro and I put all that stuff together. Then I put in my gameplay and to do that I go to my Google Drive app on my iPhone and I say open in and then it'll load a little bit and then it'll say Q Cup Pro. So then it is in my editing app. 
And then I add another video on it, which is the face cam. And I'll crop it a little bit or whatever. And I make it small and square and I put it in the corner. And now I have like a basic gaming video. I have the gameplay and then the face cam over it. And I did all that mainly using my phone and the PlayStation capture. But the thing that sucks with this is that you don't get high quality gameplay and it's a really annoying process to get all the gameplay on your phone. But if you're like me and all you have right now is this, then I definitely recommend starting your YouTube channel now and don't wait to have all the expensive equipment because if this is what you love doing, you can't go a day without it and you need to use whatever you have right now and that's that's what it's like for me there's no way i can stop doing videos and wait till i upgrade yeah that's all i have for you guys today if you guys enjoyed please leave a like and subscribe to jewels down below let me know if this helped you at all remember to follow my social medias they are linked in the description and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video bye